Lily's face radiates pure joy as she snuggles into her mother's loving embrace. In the heart of the serene park, a mother's love shines brighter than the sun. The coffee shop air hangs thick with the promise of a fresh brew. Animated cartoons have blown up online, especially on TikTok and YouTube. People are creating short story style animations and they're not just going viral, they're actually making money from them. The only problem, most tools only let you make really short videos. But today I'm gonna show you an AI tool that changes the game. With this, you can create story videos up to 60 minutes long and the best part is completely free to get started. So if you've ever wanted to start your own animation channel or post story videos that can be monetized, this is for you. Before we get started, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more tips and tools. All right, let's get into it. First, go to magiclight.ai and sign in. Once you're signed in, you'll land on a homepage like this with several different options to choose from. For this example, we're going to select story to video. Once you're on the story to video page, it should look something like this. Over here, you'll see trending animated videos that are currently popular on YouTube. You can actually grab the exact same script from an already viral animated video and the AI will rewrite the script for you to make it your own version. You can even add your own script or use the viral one as a reference to get started on a story you already have in mind. Now that I have my script, I'll go ahead and pick my aspect ratio. I'm going with this one. You can also change the language and even pick the model, but I'll leave those settings as they are for now. Next, you can choose the style of your video. I'm going to pick Disney style. At the bottom, you can also set how long you want your animated video to be. As you can see, it goes up to 30 minutes and even has a custom option. For this example, I'll set it to auto and click next. As you can see, it has generated my scenes along with my script. I can either edit it or move forward, but I'm not going to make changes, so I'll just hit next. Here's where you can create your own character or choose from pre-made ones. For this tutorial, I'll go with pre-made characters. For the little girl, I'll choose this one. For the mom, I'll select her, and for the dog, I'll pick this character. Now that I have all three of my characters selected, I'll go ahead and click next. Now we're at the storyboard. Here's where you'll see all of the animated images that have been created. You can also regenerate any images that didn't turn out correctly or just don't look right. This is where you would make those changes. But for now, I'm not going to change anything. I'll just go ahead and click next so it can generate my animated story video. You can also use motion animation, but for now, I'll skip that option and just show you the basic features of this AI. All right, now we're at the final stage. Here, you'll be able to choose your text cover, subtitles, and background music. Once you've made your selections, go ahead and click Generate. It'll ask for the aspect ratio again. Just select that and then choose your resolution. I'll leave the resolution as it is, then click OK and wait for it to generate. Here's what it, it gave me, and honestly, it looks really good. Six-year-old Amara bubbles with laughter. Her energy is bright as the day. A playful puppy leaps and bounds after a bright red ball. Each chase a burst of pure, unadulterated joy. The air is filled with the sounds of happy yelps and childish giggles, painting a vibrant picture of carefree innocence. From the porch, a mother watches, her gentle smile radiating warmth and contentment. Her eyes reflect a deep love and pride as she observes the boundless energy of her daughter and the playful antics of their furry friend. The scene is a tableau of familial bliss, bathed in the golden light of a perfect day. From the porch, Amara's mom calls out, her voice laced with concern as Amara plays with her puppy in the yard. Amara smiles softly, completely absorbed in her playful puppy, unaware of the dangers lurking nearby. Stay away from the fence, Amara. It has sharp holes and you could hurt yourself, her mother warns, her voice carrying over the sunny backyard. The camera lingers on the old wooden fence, revealing dangerous, sharp holes that pose a hidden threat to the innocent play. A playful puppy dashes towards the weathered fence, its tail wagging furiously. Amara gives chase, her laughter echoing through the sunny backyard. A sudden gasp pierces the air as her arm grazes against the fence's sharp, exposed edge. Her laughter abruptly transforms into tears as she clutches her wounded arm, her face contorted in pain. Her mom rushes to her side, kneeling down, her eyes filled with worry and affection. Sweetheart, I told you about the fence to keep you safe, her mom says, her voice gentle yet firm. Listening helps protect you. It does have a few flaws, but as we know, AI isn't perfect. 
If you get any messed up or low quality images, you can always go back to the storyboard and regenerate them to make the visuals flow better with the story. That's how you can fix those defective images. Overall, it did an excellent job putting everything together. Now I'm going to show you one more example, this time a YouTube formatted animated video. So I'll go back to story to video, choose the style of my video, pick a trending script so it can rewrite it for me, and down at the bottom where it lists the video length, I'll select auto for this one as well. Now we're at the scene editing option. I'm not going to change anything, but if I wanted to, I could add a new scene, delete a scene, or even remove part of the script. For now, I'll leave everything the same and click next. Now I'll go ahead and add in my characters. I'm going to pick her for my first character and him for the second one, then click next. All right, we're back at the storyboard. Here I can change her clothes, remove or adjust items, change facial expressions, or even switch the background. I can also adjust the narrator's voice or add sound effects. At this stage, I like to review all the AI generated images to make sure everything looks right. If I wanted to make any changes or have the AI regenerate any images, I could do that now, but this looks pretty good, so I'm going to leave everything as is. Next, I'll click next, which brings me to the section where I can change my cover text, add subtitles, and adjust my background music if I like. Once that's set, I'll hit generate, choose my aspect ratio and resolution, leave those settings as they are, and hit submit. Here's what it generated, and honestly, this looks really good. In her vibrant bedroom, Lena sits surrounded by art supplies, her bright eyes reflecting the rainy day gloom. Boredom settles over her until she unearths a golden paintbrush hidden beneath her bed. Intrigued, she dips the brush into watercolors, poised to break the monotony. With a stroke, she paints a vibrant red ball onto the paper. Its color a stark contrast to the dreary day. Suddenly, the ball pops off the page, shimmering with an otherworldly golden dust. Lena gasps, her eyes wide with wonder and disbelief. Wow, Lena's bedroom has transformed into a vibrant spectacle, with candies floating in midair. A colorful kite dances near the window, its strings tugging gently as if longing to escape. Dolls waltz gracefully on her desk, their painted eyes gleaming in the soft light. Despite the whimsical magic surrounding her, an air of profound isolation clings to Lena. A knock echoes through the enchanted room, breaking the spell of solitude. Tommy's voice, soft with sincerity, drifts in from beyond the door. I saved my last cookie for you. In the heart of the village square, Lena and Tommy stand united, a golden paintbrush radiating warmth between them. Lena begins, painting with purpose as a slide materializes, gleaming under the sunday. Tommy adds to the creation, bringing forth swings that sway gently in the breeze as the playground takes shape. A chorus of laughter erupts as children gather, their joyous energy transforming the square into a vibrant haven. Tommy smiles, filled with satisfaction. See? Sharing really does make things better. It doesn't have as many flawed images and overall looks ready to go. Now I do want to mention the credits. You get 300 credits when you sign up to get started. They also have a paid subscription option and as you can see, it's not very expensive. If you want to really get the most out of this AI tool and create animations, I definitely recommend getting a subscription. You can also purchase credits individually if you don't want to commit to a subscription. That's an option too. I'll link everything in the description if you want to try it out. I'll also leave a link for Son of Ox's YouTube thumbnail generator. It saves a ton of time when creating YouTube thumbnails and makes excellent viral quality designs. I use it myself, so I highly recommend checking it out. And like I said, I'll link everything below. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, leave a like, and if you have any questions, drop a comment below. I'll see you in the next video.